Hello, Sflopians, and welcome to another episode of Minecraft Headshot. And, uh, <clears throat> already looking at this, uh, this map, which is about to start, uh, it is a capture the flag map, and it's usually pretty hard, so decided to go ahead and go recon. Just try and go for an early push here, right at the beginning, which is not going to be very, uh, possible where I'm at right here. There is this little area down here that I can go into. It's usually flooded by uh, grenades, but early in the game you do get that uh, kind of easy momentum for, uh, you know, taking people out. People don't really notice that you're here. Okay, and then you GTFO, because I'm hearing tons of fire, and someone's following me. I know this. So I'm going to go ahead and go out this uh, this way over here. Someone's shooting at me. I heard block break. Okay, so I'll just run along the side here. And, okay. Don't shoot at me. We're teammates. And, uh, assuming that nobody takes our flag, I should be able to cap this pretty easily. Uh, that guy, uh, was shooting at me. He thought he was... I was blue. Or, he thought he was blue. Okay, so, first cap of the game. I still have a few health packs left, so I could try and go for another push here. Uh, the game has seemingly gotten a few more people than it had in the beginning. So while he's taking the brunt of the uh, fire, I can get through that tunnel pretty easily. Same concept goes right here. Okay, it looks like I'm just going to be watching this guy here. At this point... Ooh, no, 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 no. You don't take my friend out. That does not happen. Does not do that happen. Okay. Oh, I am getting the fire at the... Or I'm hearing fire, at the very least. Take that guy out. Take you out. You know, kind of just uh, give my give my teammate some help. I do not know if he still has it. So I think I'll just head back in here. Yep, someone captured it. Oh, there's a demo man there. Oh, looks like someone took him out already. Now it seems they're uh, they're kind of trying to guard their flag, or maybe not. Either way, I'm coming through. Ooh, there were uh, tons of people. I saw that person behind the uh, the wall there, but I figured I could probably get past them if I just health packed my way through there. Now, when I hear fire inside of my own base, that does make me think that there is someone here trying to capture our flag. Blue's flag has been restored. Um, I'm hearing a lot of fire, but I don't see any blue name tags, so should be relatively safe to uh, head back over to their side. Going above ground here isn't usually the best idea, but usually around late game, you find more people going to this tunnel here, but it seems most of them are actually staying around this, uh, the castle area here. So I think I'll just continue to render aid to my friends. And this third cap should be coming here pretty soon. There is a uh, a guy over here trying to get somewhere in life. But that's not going to happen because I'm going to give him a kill. Sorry. And looks like our, our friend should be getting back to the base pretty soon here, assuming that he didn't die. There's tons of fire going on around here. Drop a grenade right there, because a bunch of them are right there. Did the guy get the get the flag back to the base? I don't remember seeing anything about the flag being restored, but let's check. Oh, okay. Oh, he got me. Okay. Well, then, let's actually can use this to find out exactly where the blue flag is at. Ooh, looks like we're being stormed here. No wonder we weren't seeing very many people at uh, our base. Ooh, come on. Come on. Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Cover that flag. Oh, no, don't kill me. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Uh, protected all those guys. The blue flag uh, seems to be back at their base. So, got to head all the way back there. Thought I saw a blue name, but that was just my compass. <clears throat> I did get an airstrike flare. 
So actually, go ahead and drop it right here-ish. Hopefully that guy can't catch up to me. He didn't even chase me for some reason. With all the oh, someone does have the flag. Uh, let me just chill out around this base then. I hear someone firing. So there we go. He's done for. But now he, uh, along with some other people in his his uh, base, may know that I'm here. That guy definitely just saw me. Or at least it seemed like he did. Okay. Took him out. Uh, let's take him out too. If I can. I wish I was sniper right now. That'd be helpful. Ooh! Oh yeah, I didn't click there. There's a glitch where sometimes uh, when you reload it like automatically fires. That might not be a glitch, but seems to be a glitch. Have we captured their flag yet? And if not, why? Let me pull this back out. I'll point at blue flag, see where it's at. See who has it. <clears throat> oh, hey guy. That's awkward. Um, okay. Let me head down here. Drop a grenade behind me. Someone picked up the flag. Very nice. Oh yes, it does seem that they are still storming the base. I don't have my throwing knives anymore. So, it won't be the easiest to like one-shot them. Oh, dang. Where to go? Who has it? It's pointing this way. So I, t I heard someone take damage. It could be the person that's poisoned by it. Uh, are they about to cap it? Where is this person at? Do they even know how to play the game? You're not the person. Neither are you. Who has it? What's? Oh, hey, hey. <clears throat> you need to come up here and capture this flag. Hey, up here, up here, buddy. Right here. Here we go. Let's go. Go, go, go. And that will be the game. Oh no. Oh. Oh, it's a uh, it's a three flag game. So I think I should just go kamikaze this death here, or at least try to kill some people that are around my base, because it won't be too helpful to actually. Um. Yeah. Okay. Now that I have my throwing knives, it won't be. It wouldn't have been too easy to go capture their flag without my throwing knives, seeing as they are going kind of on more of an offensive. They're kind of camping the uh, the front of our base here. Which, which is alright. It's all in the game. All in the spirit of the game, anyway. Uh, just as long as we can come back from it. And we are already three points ahead. This guy is going to follow me. So let's just... Ooh. Hey, what's up? Oh, that's that's not good. Okay. Took him out. Ah, oh, he got me. Okay. I should have probably swung my sword at him instead of uh, shooting at him. The shooting probably was what got me killed there. And as a matter of fact, I can take this turret out. I don't think he's still shooting anyone, but I can still take him out. Um, let's see. That should be the blue guy that has our flag right now. Oh no, that was a red name, wasn't it? Okay, there is a blue guy that has our flag right now, though. Pointing at the red flag, okay. I, I need to point at the red flag, okay. Okay, okay. Now to go find this young whippersnapper. Just trying to take my flag. There you go. He's done for. Pick that flag back up and <laughs> head back over to the blue side. It's a great thing about recon in uh, capture the flag is it can capture the flag and it can stop people from uh, from having the flag pretty easily. Though all classes are pretty much are pretty good at uh, killing people for the most part. There we go. That's what I was trying to do earlier. <laughs> I kind of panicked a little bit though. Okay, got the blue flag. Let's head back. Um, if I can get out of here, this might be a tough one actually. Because as I said, they do seem to be going on the offensive now. So if they do see me. It'll be bad. However, these uh, secret tunnels are here for just what they're here for, being secret tunnels. And now, I can capture this. At least I should be able to, unless someone took our flag while it wasn't... Uh, someone did. Now then, because most people do not actually know 
how to find the other person with the flag, I'm going to have to take him out. Yeah, it's not going to be pretty easy. It's not going to be very easy because as soon as someone sees me with their flag, I'm going to be targeted. Ugh. This is a difficult. Okay, okay. He's stuck in the water here. Yes! There we go. Now, cover my flag. I probably should have left it there, um, thinking more tactically, uh, because it would have given me more time to actually get back to the base without the possibility of someone else uh, taking our flag. So, note for the future, that's what you should do. Uh, probably just leave the, leave the flag there if you can, if you're as far away from uh, your own base as I am right now. However, it does seem as if their uh, their raid of our base has uh, taken a back seat for now. So I can get this capture and possibly even get another one. If I do, then I'll be pretty proud of myself because I would mean three captures <clears throat> from just me. Ooh, oh! Not to mention the uh, what was it? Two times that I stopped someone from capturing our flag. So, ooh, okay. I don't know if any of you guys saw that, but uh, <laughs> I just threw it, it bounced off the wall, and he walked right into it. Very nice, very nice kill, I must say. Is this ours? Is oh. Yeah, it was ours, but I guess that was the last use of it that we had. Because I did get a... Uh-oh. Uh Peace. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, that was my last health pack, too. Okay, kamikaze. Let's, let's do that. Or, I may be able to capture the flag. We kind of just traded knives there. Okay, take that guy out. Ooh, yeah! Okay, if I did get a care package, it would be useful because... Uh, oh, I did! I did! Oh, give me that health, give me that health. Oh, no, it gave me ammo! Oh, I'm not going to get back to the base. Second, I take more uh, poison damage. I can get as close to the base as I can, though. Uh, I am on the right side, so I've got to remember that. Ooh, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty close. I may be able to actually come back and grab. Ooh. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's just die right here. So I know exactly where it's at. Threw a few grenades just for uh, lulz. Okay. Now then, head back to where I was just a second ago. Oh gosh, this lag. Whoa, okay. Picked it right back up. So picked it right back up. Uh, you do have that uh, invincibility kind of thing there. The resistance, anyway. So you don't take fall damage. And this is a game. Okay, so that, that went on a little bit uh, longer than I thought. But the end. I think the ending score... This is my KD for the uh, for that game, so 5.57, not too bad. Uh, and considering I didn't actually try to kill that many people, let's just go ahead and do slash GG for uh, sportsmanship. Oh, oh, actually, I do like this map. This is a good sniper map, so I think I'm gonna go and try and go sniper on this one. And I believe this is actually uh, a team deathmatch one, so the more kills, the better. So about 40 seconds till it starts. I think I'll just uh, skip until it, it's about to start. Okay, here it is about to start. Um, I did pick sniper, so I should have all the sniper materials. This is actually a really fun map. I uh, I was playing on it with uh, Zap underscore Brannigan one, and uh, we had quite the time playing on this map. Uh, me and him both being snipers, and we even switched up our kits a little bit. But uh, we were on opposite teams, so we kept trying to kill each other. Anyway, uh, yeah, let's go ahead. This is my spawn beacon. As you guys know, I think I may have showcased uh, this a little bit more or in, in other videos. But the spawn beacon, uh, when you die, you will respawn wherever your spawn beacon was. So it's quite helpful, especially when you're trying to maintain a uh, sniping position. However, it does help the other team get like multiple kills on you. I still do not know exactly where you want to aim for uh, headshots. 
I know in uh Ooh, ooh, this guy's going for the combat. Oh, he took me out. Okay. Um I did get one kill for that death, so it's not I'm not that useless. Let me go ahead and try and Okay, took him out. Um I do know that in Capture the Flag you have to be a certain amount of blocks away from someone to actually get the headshot. And I believe that certain number is uh, 20 or 25. Don't quote me on that, but uh, I, I do think that is the way... Ooh. But I think on here you're just supposed to... Uh, oh, come on, that didn't take him out. Ah, this lag. I keep getting little lag spikes, very small ones, dropping my FPS from like 90 to 60, but still the... And that guy, just <laughs> I just saw a name fly across there, and then it disappeared, so... Autoban, thank you very much. See, I think it is, you just have to aim for like the neck. That head there kind of confused me. Mm. Ah. Reload the gun. Maybe able to take him out with that grenade. Oh. If he stood still for like two seconds more. Go, took him out. The other the the really cool thing about sniper is you you do get a lot of kills usually, if you're good with it. So you can get a good amount of uh care packages and uh whatnot. Should not actually place your spawn beacon out like this, because if someone comes from there and kills you like right here and you just respawn right back here they kill you again so you know that's kind of what I was talking about earlier with the uh, the people getting double kills on you one thing I didn't want to mention though I, I am uh, deeply sorry for not having that uh, Hunger Games video yesterday I was just really tired I kind of really enjoyed my weekend uh, and I just didn't really have a lot of time I was really active this weekend I was working out, I swam in the pool like 24-7 because we had just gotten our pool fixed. Uh, but you guys don't really want to hear about that. Ah, uh, oh, that reload. Mm. I really got to start paying attention to my the amount of bullets that I have. Um, but yeah, so I was just really tired and I didn't really have the time. I did have the time, but I spent it doing other things, obviously. Oh! Guy, stop shooting at me when there's a blue guy right in front of you. <laughs> there was a diamond down there that was just shooting at me. Oh, God. Yeah, the lag on here is unbearable sometimes. Like, right now, <laughs> where it's just, it's it's not really laggy. I'm still getting about 50 FPS, which a lot of people would consider, like, <clears throat> a lot. But when I'm not recording, like right now, F3, I'm getting around 99 but you see kind of how it's going down about 20 right there it just went down to 40 um oh for a second there it went down to 16 but some people would think that uh say 50 fps is actually a lot oh, jeez jeez louise i think i'm on the red team um <laughs> uh i'm not seeing too many opportunities for me to actually snipe people from where I'm at. God, I need to start paying attention to the amount of bullets that I have. That's just unsettling when you get a kill all lined up and everything, and then you just don't have the bullets for it. Ooh, he saw me. Okay. Cover's blown. See, I did get that uh, airstrike there. Like I said earlier, you do get a lot of uh, airstrikes, and you do get a lot of uh, care packages, which are really helpful uh, when you're trying to maintain a spot like I am kind of right here because if you do get a lot of kills you do uh, you do end up getting uh, the care packages which will either give you health packs and I used to say that they didn't give you anything but uh, sometimes it glitches and uh, like that care package I got earlier gave me health packs and as you saw I just ate one of my health packs and it gave me more so that's kind of glitched out uh, so it does that Oh, oh, I thought I only had one more left, so I right click to reload. Uh, I wish there was a separate button for reloading so you could like reload when you aren't like not full on bullets so you can just top yourself off. 
but you know what it's it's all right uh, <clears throat> so yeah the the health and sometimes it gives you ammo which is it's it's easily evident when you do get the ammo but when you get the health it sometimes glitches out so yeah the lag on this map I swear I mean I don't usually get that much lag but like everyone gets lag on this server pretty much because it is what it is it's a it's a laggy it's a laggy server it's a laggy game mode uh, but geez I don't usually get this much lag on it it may be because I'm recording Which would make some sense uh, did I just get shot at? Yeah, I did. Oh, oh, <laughs> he's a demo man too. He's shooting grenades at me. That's not good. Ooh, ooh. Still, he's kind of trying to see if he kills me up here. Ooh. I wonder if that's my team or his team. Anyway. He may think that I messed, I fudged off. Ooh. Time to reload. Thing I used to, uh, keep my eyes on my ammo. Oh yeah. Got him. Okay, I thought that was a blue name over there see what the score is 71 to 41 so it does look like red team's kind of got this in the bag it's very good because I wanted to take the time to uh, kind of talk to you guys a little bit in this episode because I don't I, I really wanted to get a uh, solo Hunger Games recording does this guy think I'm not here is that it there we go he's gone he's out of my life he is the dead um I really wanted to record a solo Hunger Games because I have been you know recording a lot of Team Hunger Games, which, as I know, are interesting, and uh, I'm sure fun to watch, but at the same time, you know, y you don't kind of, like, you don't really get to see me killing people on my own that much, which is what, what Hunger Games is really for, <clears throat> and I don't really get to talk to you guys that much, and, you know, it's it's... It's just different, like the the game style, the game style, and everything. Okay, Let's see, I get this hair, care package here. I don't know what kill streak I'm on, but okay. Let's see, it gave me a stack of uh, ammo there when I only had seven. So, <gasps> ooh, that scared me. And someone just threw a grenade at me. Okay, let's kind of try to get back up here. This is a, probably the best pot. Uh, I don't think I've died too much. I don't think I've actually... I think I've died once <laughs> in this match. Which is pretty good. Finally the recon repot killed me. Ooh, ooh, ooh. See, if I had a grenade, I could... Oh! I had a 13 kill streak. Okay, that's good to know. And since I was up here for a while, I can just place this right back down. Um, Jeez, there were tons of people down there. If I had my grenades, that would have been good. Mm. But they did all notice me. And that's one thing about, uh... About this kit, you have to be pretty stealthy. Uh, make sure, making sure that nobody really sees you. Because once you do, and if that person is a... Uh, sniper. Like that person that just killed me was. They can usually uh, one-shot you. So... And not to mention, snipers are actually really frail in this, so. so pretty much any class can take them out. <laughs> gotta, gotta be pretty good to uh, use it. Or you don't really have to be, but... You know what? Jeez. <laughs> He's missing me every time. Ooh! Ooh! Okay. That awkward moment when... I think it may be about time to uh, change my position here. Ooh, see, if I could just get people as they walk through here... Like that. That's, that's me being useful right there. 
I do gotta refill though. Or, ooh, there you go. That's what heavies are for. <laughs> Helping me take people out. Okay, that that person just lagged on through. That was a beautiful couple shots by me. And I guess I missed that grenade too. <laughs> This guy's playing very smart, actually. The way he is playing. We kind of walked past and then... Ooh! He got me. He did, in fact, get me. Ooh, a free care package here just waiting for me to pick it up. I believe that one was health because it didn't give me any ammos. Uh, one thing about uh, care packages is if you're like under a roof like this and I place my care package right here it drops from the sky so it's gonna drop on the top of this roof and sometimes you you do that and you can't actually you know retrieve your care package at that point sadly blue team it does seem like is going to lose <laughs> oh god they just I guess they just didn't go on the offense soon enough they, they played a little bit too cautiously probably Looks like someone else took him out. Um, there we go. See, that is no waste of the bullets. No wasted bulletos. When you uh, kill with each one. So I do believe with on headshot, all you have to do is hit them in the actually hit them in the head. Someone did just try to throw a grenade at me there. I have one bullet left in my gun. I would have liked to have gotten a kill with it. Throwing a grenade in that crowd would be very... See, when, uh, <clears throat> when one team kind of just pins the other team down on this map, it's really easy to just get a bunch of kills. Like, right here. It's usually the <laughs> that person was trying to throw knives all the way up here. Just funny. Okay, I don't really need this health pa the care package, but you know, ammo's ammo. Never going to deny myself ammo. Uh, but yes, it does seem as if this match is about to come to a close. Especially this uh, final push, just getting tons of kills, pretty much making sure, you know, they're not going to have a comeback, even though we were already about 40 kills ahead or something like that. Um, it is nice to still go for a push and actually, you know, make sure for a fact they're not going to get those kills. I suppose my team is kind of just going for overkill here <laughs> at this point, um, but you know, it's all in good fun. Ooh, this guy might kill me, actually. I think I'll maybe showcase uh, some of the other classes in this next in the next game that I do. Because just playing... Like, I got 30% of the kills. Wow. I feel like I didn't actually get that many kills because I've been talking so much, but uh, hopefully you guys don't mind that, actually. It always feels good to take out another sniper. Don't know why. Um, but yeah, it would be kind of cool to showcase some of these other uh, classes. But anyway, that's going to be the end of the ma match. <laughs> um, that would be a 2-0 for red, which was my team. So yeah, laggy as it may be, it's quite fun. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.